I looked it up and Google said that the tickets thirty thousand damn dollars. Like, baby, that's rich people stuff that I can't even just. I, so we just gonna let rich people do rich people stuff. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. Another day, another video. Um, and for today's video, we're gonna be rating the Matt Gala looks from on a scale of one to ten. And I'm actually excited about this. Well, not too excited, cause I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. I was kind of disappointed with the um Matt Gala looks um this year. I ain't even gonna lie. I'm sorry. Like more, like most of them. Well, I'm gonna put it like this. It was more looks that I didn't like rather than looks that I did like. And I hate to say it, but it is what it is. But anyway, um, before we get into this video, y'all, make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe, follow me on all social medias, and we finna get straight into this video. Some of the Matt Gala looks was like, I don't know, some of them I feel like they could have been a little better, and some of them was good. And I mean, like a few of them was good, I ain't gonna lie to you. Well, at least a few that I seen, cause come on now, it was at least, it was hundreds of people who went to the Met Gala. Hell, it could have been thousands. I don't know. There's rich people stuff. I don't know nothing about that. But I'm just saying, it was a lot of people there. And so I ain't just going to say that everybody looks was like bad or whatever. But I'm just saying like the ones that I seen, like they weren't, you know, the best. And some of them did good. So I ain't being nigga to nasty. But some of them, you know, wasn't all that. But okay, so... The first one, we're gonna start with my girl, Chloe Bailey. Y'all know I love, well, y'all probably don't know that, but I'm a, I'm a big fan of Chloe. I love her, um, like, just from the way, the way that she performed, the way her vocals be so controlled, I just, I'm a fan of Chloe. But, um, but yeah, so, Chloe outfit, um, on a scale one to 10, I'm gonna get this, I'm gonna get this, a nine on it. No, I, I give it an eight and a half because honestly, Chloe, she looked it real pretty. Like I love the blonde hair that she still rocking. I love her jewelry. The shoes was cute. Her toenail polish was cute. Like the dress is just like it give me like elegant vibes. It's cute. Like it's cute. I give it. I give it a nine. But I mean, no, a, a eight or an eight and a half. I, wait, what did I say? I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Y'all yeah, already know. I'm a little zooty, so if I forget, don't don't get me. But um, yeah, I give it like a eight, eight and a half. Um, yeah, she looked good. But you know, when I think of like the Met Gala, I think of like like kind of dramatic type stuff. You know what I mean? Okay, next her sister Hallie. Oh my God, Hallie, she. I love to look for real like for one she got a nice little petite body like the shoes was cute the like her outfit gave me like Tina Turner type vibes you know what I mean like with the like sh um strings and stuff and then baby her body was glistening you can tell like it looked like she probably got like some type of like bronc like highlight on or something I don't know but her body was glistening I don't know baby but she looked good though like she real pretty i'm gonna get this honestly i'm gonna get this a 10 i ain't gonna lie to you okay billy eilish um billy eilish this is what i mean when i say oh lord oh lord the light is trying to act weird so i'm just gonna have to get a little close because the light is starting to be funny honey you know what i'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go get my brain light because the light's starting to act weird now. This, baby, this sunlight is kind of playing. It's like it's hiding behind clouds and coming back out. It just, you know, hey, don't get the rain light doing too much. But anyway, um, okay, Billy Eilish. Um, Billy Eilish. Okay, when it comes to like the dramatic aspect of the outfit, I love it because. Like I said, when I think of like the Met Gala, like you would think that, you know, people do like just, you know, something like real extravagant, real bold, something that stand out, something that's just like over the top. So I do like the long train and I like how, like how big it is, like kind of puffy, kind of sort of. I do like that. Um, you know, but the dress, okay, I'll give it a solid seven and a half. I'll give it a seven and a half. She looked pretty. 
Okay, Justin Bieber and Hailey Bieber. Uh, hmm. I'm gonna give Justin, I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm sorry, but the outfit that Justin had on at the VMAs was just ridiculous. The, I'm like, I don't know what's up with him and these baggy tuxedos, like baggy blazers and stuff, but I'm not digging it. I don't know, maybe it's just his, you know, I guess wherever he from, that's that fashion, but you know, I'm not digging it. Um, I'm gonna give it, a, I'm gonna give Justin a solid, his outfit. I, Alfie is a, a 4 or a 5. I give him a 5. Um, Haley, she looked at cute. I give her Alfie a... I give it a, a, a 7. Because, like, like I said, it's cute, but it's plain. Like, you... The Matt Gala is supposed to be just over the top. You know what I mean? Like, this give me, like, award show vibes. You know what I mean? Now, Tracy um, Ellis Ross... Um, I ain't gonna lie, I like this. It was different. It was it was cute. I'll give it like a seven and a half. Um, but the hair gotta go. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> like it's giving me the hair was giving me very much uh you know the um the the I forgot is it despicable me? The you know the dude with the glasses with the short hair. Now, I'm not sure if that's the, the right movie, but it's giving me very much like that, them type of vibes. Okay, so ASAP Rocky and Rihanna. Um, I ain't gonna lie. I love me some ASAP Rocky. I love me some Rihanna, but I'm not gonna lie. First of all, we're gonna start with Rihanna. Honestly, it looked like she just took her comforter off her bed and just wrapped it around her and put a black cap on. I ain't even gonna lie. Her makeup was real pretty. Rihanna will forever be a bad bitch. But I'm just saying that, no, I was not digging it at all. And ASAP Rocky, he looked like some cereal. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. Is it, it what is it? Captain Crunch cereal? He give me very much milk and cereal. I'm sorry. I don't know what this was. Um... Maybe the look that they was going with was more like bed type quilt comforter set type vibes. I don't know, but I wanna deep it. Um, okay, no money. Um No money, I love it. I ain't gonna lie, I love the dress. This is what I mean when I when I said, you know, when I think of like the Met Gala give me very much dramatic. You see what I'm saying? I love it. It was dramatic, big. I love like the shoulder part, but I'm not gonna lie, the hair, she could have did better with the hair. Like I watched a T page and I know you people gonna be like, you watching the TV page? Okay, I watch the T page sometimes. It be on YouTube, it pop up. I'm sorry. But, and then this one girl, she was like, uh, how Normani would have looked it cute with maybe like a, a swoop with a ponytail or something like that. I think that would have been cute. But this hairstyle, no, ma'am, no, ma'am, no, ma'am. Um, okay, Tessa, I don't really know this. Well, I know she, okay, so I've seen her in a few movies, but I don't know, I've never like, heard nobody pronounce her name so i don't know if i'm pronouncing it right but i think her name tessa may thompson something like that i think that's right um i ain't gonna lie she was serving honey oh my gosh this light is i'm gonna have to get a little closer y'all because this light ain't it ain't it ain't doing what it's supposed to do but anyway um so she i ain't gonna lie she did everything she was supposed to do like she ate i ain't gonna lie i like this it was giving me very much rose, like roses, like garden type vibes. But not to be funny, but like it, she, I liked it a lot. It looked real cute. My bad, liked it a lot. I said liked it, I'm so country. I've been trying to work on this proper English, baby, but sometimes it don't work out. Um, okay, Miss Regina King, baby. Uh, I don't know, it was okay. It was, it was all right. Uh, Regina, I'm gonna give her, I don't know, I'm gonna give her like a six. I don't know, I just want feeling it. It's not, I like the look, the look, you know, blazer, long blazer or whatever, the gold in the inside, but I don't know, I just, it, you know, I, when I look at the Met Gala, I look for like extravagant, you know what I mean? Like, uh, over the top, dramatic. I don't know. Um, so the next one, Shakari 
Richardson. What? Oh, never mind. I'm, look, I'm looking at her Instagram. I'm like, I'm like they spill it. Car anyway, I'm going to cut it out. Okay, so Shakari Richardson. Um, I don't know. It was giving me Vikings type vibes. I don't know. I'm going to get this a six. Uh, I'm not really just feeling it. Um, Simone Biles, I ain't gonna lie, this was beautiful to me. I love the hair, I like the earring, like, this was beautiful. I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna get this a 10. Um, Winnie, Winnie Harlow, um, it's, I don't know. Um, I get this like a, I get this like an 8. I like, the, I don't know. Yeah, I give it an 8, it's cute. Um, Alicia Keys, I don't know why, but, and I'm not trying to, you know what, I ain't, I'm going to keep that to myself. But, um, Alicia Keys, I like the long train. It's very dramatic. I like the long train. But, I don't know, it's okay. I give it an A. It's cute. She, Alicia Keys is beautiful. Like, she, you know, from head to toe, all together, it's an A. It's cute. But I don't know, just, I'm just, I ain't gonna lie, I'm not really feeling the ruffles. I don't know. Um, uh, Gabrielle Union, she get me, I don't know, like, this, I don't know, I don't know. I hate to say it, but it give me, like, dinosaur fish scale type vibes. I don't know. Um, but it was different and it was unique, so I'll give it, I'll give it a, a eight and a half. Um, okay, Steph Curry and Aisha Curry. Don't get me wrong, both of them look good. Aisha is beautiful. But, and her dress was, was real pretty. But, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna give her, it, it's not, it's giving me award show kind of sort of. Like, I don't know. I give it, I give it a, a, a eight and a half. A nine, the dress is cute, but I just, she should have had like a head piece or something like give me like i'm talking when i think of the met gala i think of like hunger games type you know how like on hunger games how the girl um who won um katniss she came out in a, a dress that was on fire kind of like uh kanye west did how he was on fire like i'm talking about stuff like that and you know the girl the lady on the hunger games who was hosting it um she was like real pale with the like blonde hair just like how she i'm thinking like stuff like that like alice in wonderland type fashion not exactly like that but you know how it was like over the top dramatized the like that's why i think of the Met gala that's what i think of you know anyway um mary j blige um the dress was real pretty but i give it like an eight and a half giving me like award show type vibes um megan the stallion um i'm not gonna say really what i want to say but i love megan the stallion but she was real cute the makeup cute the hair cute megan the stallion was real cute but um i just feel like it, it did give me kind of like prom type vibes but in the interview um at the Met Gala she did say that she had just came back from London at four at like four in the morning stuff like that so I guess she kind of like put it together you know real quick but it's giving me she looked at cute but it's just giving me like prom type vibes I ain't gonna lie oh my god this lighting is really is me the it's really pissing me off y'all crap but is it me or is it or is the lighting giving me like it's it's dark damn light, dark damn light. But anyway, let's move on. I get distracted easy. Okay, now this girl name was the real. Is it E Man or I Man? Iman? I don't know. But this was so pretty. In my in my honest opinion, I truly feel like that she was best dressed. Like when I say dramatic size, like like just elegant, but like just over the top. This is exactly what I mean. She ate. She did what she was supposed to do. Uh, Lil Nas X. I ain't gonna lie. Lil Nas X. He did pop his shit too. I ain't gonna lie. Um, I'm not gonna have all three of the looks that he had, but he had like this little long gold cape. So pretty. So, looks so good. Look very expensive. And then the second part under it, like when he took it off, it was like he gave me very much like robot, like a robot, like I don't know, like Iron Man type gold, except for all gold or something. And then this outfit, this outfit was cute. Um, just 
you know, you can tell he put in a lot of effort just off the effort. I'm gonna give it like a nine and a half. I ain't gonna lie, almost a 10, but I'm gonna give it a nine and a half. The, it would have been a 10, but I ain't gonna lie. I'm not just feeling the, the jumpsuit, not all that much, but like the fact that he had a damn robot suit on and a damn cape, gold ass, long ass cape, I'm gonna give it a nine and a half. But the, I mean, the jumpsuit give it like a few points off. This light is, I don't know what's wrong. Okay, there we go. A little better now, I think. Um, anyway, um, Yara Shahidi, um, it was pretty. I ain't gonna lie, her outfit was pretty. It was giving me, you know, old school Hollywood vibes. Like, I liked it. Um, I'm gonna give it like an eight and a half. Um, sweetie, she giving me, it was cute. Sweetie always look good, period. But I'm just saying, um, I don't know. I give I give Sweetie like a I give Sweetie a, a nine just cause she fine and the outfit cute. But it's I, I wish j more of like a headpiece or some like super dramatic jewelry or some like um Kiki Palmer. Um I'm sorry, she was giving me a war show vibes. I'm sorry, like she looked it real pretty. I'm not saying she looked it bad, but you know, oh, like award show vibes. Um, and yeah, y'all, that's all the people that I got. Like I said, it was hundreds of people going to the um to the Met Gala, but I'm I'm just telling y'all all the ones that I seen. Um, but you know, everybody did nobody just look horrible. Um, but you know. A few people could be a little bit, but that everybody looking good. You know, I can't really say too much because, baby, I looked it up and Google said that the tickets thirty thousand damn dollars. Like, baby, that's rich people stuff that I can't even just. I, so we just gonna let rich people do rich people stuff. But um, yeah, I just have to give y'all my opinion on um the Met Gala looks twenty twenty one. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If y'all did, why am I yelling? I yell all the time. I'm country, my bad. Yeah, okay, y'all, that's pretty much it for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe, comment, follow me on all social medias, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook. I don't got no Twitter, but yeah. Uh, follow me on all that, um, and I'll see y'all in my next video.